Our Wendy's Male High School Athlete of the Week. He is a junior running back for Topeka High, and he is coming off of a huge game this past Friday night in Highland Park. He runs for a ton of yards, four total touchdowns, 263 yards to be exact. Tylen Alejos from Topeka High. And Tylen, let's start right there with the game this past Friday against Highland Park. It's your second game of the season, and you put up these huge numbers. What was working so well for you offensively and on special teams with the kick return touchdown against Highland Park? Oh, yes, sir. Um, my line, my line came really through clutch. They came nice block, good blocks all night long. They tried hard, so I just had to give them – a reward basically for what they were doing out there. Obviously, this is a crazy season for everyone, but especially you got to Topeka High since you started the season so late. What has the process been like getting adjusted to having your week two be everybody else's week five? Uh, it's kind of hard. It's like difficult because like what how we would look now is what we would look like in the summer during all of our camps, um, fixing things, fine tuning things. So yeah, we're just kind of getting back on track, and it's been a little difficult, but it's nothing that we can't manage. What was it like, you know, seeing guys that you know who play at other schools in the city be playing through the first three weeks of the season, whereas you guys had six weeks of practice nonstop? What was that like compared to some prior off seasons, just in the way you were feeling? Um, it's kind of good because, like, we have a young team, so it's kind of like a lot of pre preparation to get them ready and stuff. And it was, like, nice seeing my friends get to play because usually we're always playing, so we never get to see each other. So it was nice getting to see them play. Our Wendy's Male Athlete of the Week is Tylen Alejos, junior running back from Topeka High. Now, you are coming into this season, like you said, it's a very young team for Topeka High, and you're replacing yeah. something of a legend yourself at running back in your yeah. Kai Thomas. What has it kind of been like moving into that role and not being the featured guy for the Trojans offense? Um, I've been preparing for it for a long time because he's been there for a while, did a lot of great things, and he's a good leader. So I kind of learned a lot behind him. I was going to ask you, too, not only have you learned a lot from him, but is there anyone else, either a former teammate or maybe someone in the college or pro game who you like to model your game after? Um, I, th I like um, Le'Veon Bell back when he was at the Steelers, how he was patient and just hit the hole. Now, I know you not just are the starting running back to speak high, but you've got plenty of experience defensively, too, a standout linebacker. We had you guys on our airwaves a couple times last year, and I mean, you were all over the field making plays along with running back. Do you have a preference what you play, offense or defense, or is it pretty much just whatever gets you on the field? Yeah, whatever gets me on the field. I just like, I just like being an athlete, getting out there on my guys. Now, to start off this season, we mentioned you're just two games in so far, but you've put up big numbers, almost 10 yards per touch, over 300 yards rushing so far. When you look back on this year, what were some of your goals entering this season? And I know it's just two games so far, but do you think you're on your way to beating them through two games? Um, I would like to think so. Well, I would like to think if you had those other games, I'd have like a couple, couple, like a couple more hundred yards of rushing. But it's how it turned out, so I had to like um, switch my goals around just a little bit. We're speaking with Tylen Alejos, our Wendy's Male Athlete of the Week, running back from Topeka High, who's coming off of a performance of over 260 yards and four total touchdowns this past Friday night. Now let's go from the past and into the future, the rest of this season, because obviously there's still a long way to go with the regular season and the playoffs. What are some of your personal goals for the rest of the season? Um, just to get as many wins as we can, help, help the person who's behind me, show them the right way, just like how um, Kai did me, just give them a point of reference to look at and just be the example. Going into your new position this year, not just your experience as a starter defensively, but now as a starter offensively, how have you kind of felt yourself become more of a leader for your team? Have you kind of taken on more of that leadership role for the younger guys? Yeah, because like you said, it's a lot of young kids. So I'm just showing them like the Topeka Highway, how we play, how we carry ourselves in the halls and stuff like that. Now, you are just a junior this year, so you've got another year to go at Topeka High playing high school football. Do you think that football might be in your collegiate or other types of future once you're done at Topeka High? Um, I plan it to be. If, if that's what happens, that's what happens. But, yeah, I plan for it to be. Have you talked to any schools yet or talked to any coaches or former teammates about the process of looking at colleges for football? Yeah, I talked to um, my Carlos Kelly, our head coach, Toby and Thomas, and then Kai also. Well, he's having a phenomenal junior season. Tylen Alejos, over 300 yards rushing so far this year, four total touchdowns and a win over Highland Park this past Friday night, and he is our Wendy's Male High School Athlete of the Week. Tylen, thank you so much for joining us, and good luck the rest of the season. Thank you.